Well, it was all systems go for the launch of a new weather rocket down in Florida. Stormwatch team meteorologist Meredith Garfalo in Cape Canaveral tonight with what this means for the future of forecasting. So exciting. Together, we watch NOAA's GOES-T satellite lift off and head into space. But the journey is just beginning. And lift from the launch pad into the sky, the next stop is separating from the rocket. Then, in just over a week, it will join its sister satellites above the Earth. So what we need to do now is use the engine of the spacecraft itself and fly to 22,000 plus miles to the geostationary orbit. That's the place where you can sit and stare down and it rotates exactly at the same speed as the Earth. So that's where we are. The team of Goes West and East will monitor and capture everything from snowstorms to tropical systems to even wildfire smoke that impacts us here across the Northeast. And once it gets into geostationary orbit, the satellite gets a number, so this would be GOES-18. And then they're going to swap it out with our current GOES-West satellite, which watches over the entire western hemisphere. So for your Stormwatch team meteorologist, that helps us keep an eye on and get more information on storm systems that are approaching the tri-state region. At NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida, Meredith Garfalo, News 12.